The European Parliament's self-appointed Brexit negotiator was asked during an online question and answer would he in Brussels be offering the opportunity for Britons to be attached to the EU. After Britain leaves, Mr Verhofstadt welcomed the question, showing his delight that people even outside of the European project still wanted to be a part of it. The former Belgian Prime Minister has been a critic of Britain's EU divorce, even pushing to ensure the recent agreement struck up between Theresa May and the European Commission is enshrined in law. After Brexit Secretary David Davis said it was not legally binding, Mr Verhofstadt said there are many UK citizens contacting him, who still want to belong to the European Union, EP Getty Brexit. News guy the Hofstadt is ready to offer Britons a route back into the European Union if a UK citizen wants to retain some of the rights that are in this EU citizenship. I'm positive about that guy the Hofstadt. I think we have to respond positively to them, he added, and not say it's difficult because they no longer have any EU nationality because Britain will be out of the European Union. British nationality is not enough to have EU citizenship anymore. There is no link anymore. So, why not give something similar? Offer them something similar. If an individual UK citizen wants to retain some of the rights that are in this EU citizenship, I'm positive about that. It will be one point to discuss it inside the European Union, and secondly, to discuss in it the second phase with the UK, as Theresa May's agreement on the Irish border, EU citizens' rights and the so-called Brexit divorce bill was debated in the European Parliament in Strasbourg, Mr Verhofstadt to once again target Britain for its decision to quit the bloc. He said UK bankers should not be allowed to have a better deal than a Romanian doctor a Polish plumber, during a furious parliament speech. Mr Verhofstadt said, we will never allow that. A European banker living in the city will have enough money to pay a very important price and a Polish plumber or a Romanian doctor cannot make it. I think this parliament can never give the green light on the agreement if we have not within the withdrawal agreement a simple procedure, a declaration, one form per family, cost-free and where the burden of proof is on the Home Office and not on the back of our citizens. Friday, December 8, 2017 Here is the 15-page Brexit deal in full. He also said EU citizens could not trust the Home Office to guarantee their rights in the UK after Brexit. Nobody trusts the Home Office, he blasts. Citizens' rights are worth nothing if they're drowned in a sea of red tape, if they're bucked down in rules and regulations and to make it more understandable.